Scratch Attack, so let me know down below. Are the regular Premier League cards done by Adrenaline? I do have an Adrenaline pack in here, and I believe that's this season's Premier League, but let me know. When I first started, I used to collect these uh, when I was in school. When I was in primary school. started doing it, it was shootout, and then, which I really wanted to get it back, but they were quite overpriced. Um, and then it changed to match attacks, and I did it, like, probably for about four years, and then when I went to secondary school, I, uh, I stopped. So, it says these packs are stacked. Three special insert cards guaranteed per packet. That's, that's really nice for the, for the sake of this video. Is a guaranteed per packet. 
this was a thing, let me know down below if you collect these or play this, whatever. Two or three metal cards per pack, which is pretty neat. So hopefully we get five star Lord Voldemort or whatever. It's made by Benini. It's very cool. I'm not going to try tracing this pack because the um, writing is way too small. Way too small indeed. Right, let's get these out. Here we go. Okay, so we got the little promo thingy here. What is that little booklet? It's cute. Okay, first up we are Cedric Dickory, played by Robert Pattinson. Dancing with Joe Chang. Rest in peace. That's my boy. Nice. 
I would do some dubbing guys, but the mic is like centre directional so it wouldn't really pick it up. Okay, so first up we've got Starship. We have a Star Destroyer. We have Response. Okay, so I assume this is actually like a... I guess this is like a trap card, what does that say at the top? Concentrate or fire. Response. Scout Soloma Alien Scout Pilot We've got an Imperial Trooper Excuse my stomach SD4402 Tatooine Garrison <laughs> Nice Got a Jawa Little Jawa Major top trumps vibes. I used to love playing top trumps. We got an Imperial Trooper. So RGA972 Assault Specialist. Interesting. We got. I have no idea who this dude is. No idea who this dude is. Erbic. Erbrinian. 9000. I literally cannot read that. So this is a weapon card. A weapon card. We have Black 2. Black 2, one of the TIE Fighters. Oh, we got Grand Moth Tarkin. Very nice. I thought he was very well, uh, very well done in Rogue One in terms of bringing him back. Oh, is that it? Oh, that was our last card. shinies and hollows and whatnot in, in some of these sets. But if there are, we're not having much luck, are we? Next, we should have a pretty popular one. I think Dido opened a pack of these on his channel once. A uh, booster box, that is. Minecraft trading cards again by Benini. So we have the odds down here. Collection of 250 regular cards, 100 regular, 100 pixels, 3 per pack, and then 3 every 2 packs, so 1 every 1.5 packs, rainbow cards, okay, so hopefully we can get a rainbow, that's our first sort of hit of the video. Scissors again, that's let's do it. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Let's get them out from the bottom. Oh, they come in. Uh, I did not do that very well at all. There we go. Okay, I wonder if they're all going to be sideways like this again. Quite reflective, you can see me in the back. Hello, hello, hello. So we are. Why am I getting 
Spider-Man villains and 
vibes, I can't play the game. Well, what first hollow, what first hollow is a Thanos. Thanos. Very cool. I think this is a way too small for me to try this. Thanos. I do like the back of these cards as well. Mercedes uh, garage where they make the cars and stuff. They don't walk through on lunch break like to where I uh, to where I live. And uh, it was in the Netflix documentary Drive to Survive, which is pretty cool because it's quite a small place. Anyway, Turbo Attacks official Formula One trading card game. My favourite driver is Lando, so anything Lando related, and I'll be happy. Milestone moment for show Guan Yu. Guan Yu. First Chinese driver to race in F1. We have. <laughs> I don't know. I'm busy driving. Public service announcement from Nico Hulkenberg. Nico Hulkenberg. We have Leonardo Finale here, right? Oh, I see. So there's F3 in here as well. That's pretty cool. I'm, I'm, I'm not really clued in on my F3, I can't lie. We have Pierre Gasly qualifying master. It's cool. It's a cool card. We have live action Charles Leclerc Monte Carlo 2022. So we've got Checo. This is the Mexican way. The public service announcement from Sergio Perez, or Checo Perez. We have a milestone moment, most Grand Prix starts in history. It's obviously by Fernando Alonso. We have F2, Isaac, Ajal, Isaac Ajal. Oh, we got a McLaren, is it going to be Lando? Genuinely, what are the odds of that? <laughs> what are the odds of that? We get a hollow Lando Norris card F1 next gen. That's actually sick. That is sick. I can't believe that. And then we also get Kevin Magnussen ball position lap of 2022. Tops awards. Well, I'm well happy with that. And Lando's my favourite racer is during lockdown one. I watched a lot of his live streams, like when he played Among Us and uh, not Among Us, Four Guys and Golf with Your Friends, that kind of thing. So, I like him as a personality. Well, that was great. I feel like the balls are picking up now. We're, we're, we're flowing. <laughs> now we have another popular set. Oh, you can really see me in the background. Hello, Yu Gi Oh! I. We've got first edition English edition Shining Victories, but again, I don't think this is a super sought after set. I think I picked this up for pretty cheap. Because again, we're not really looking for balls, we're looking for 
since I was about eight or nine. I'm 25 now, so this is awesome. Basically, when I was in primary school, I don't know if it's the same for everybody else, but the crazes sort of alternated between Match Attacks, Pokemon, and Yu-Gi-Oh! But Yu-Gi-Oh! and Match Attacks were kind of done at the same time. Anyway, we have Beacon of White, Spell Card. Fortissimo. Fortissimo Spell Card. We've got Master with Eyes of Blue. I still have my Yu-Gi-Oh! card somewhere. I think I used to collect the, was it the Roids? Like Garroid? Or oh, something like that. Raid, Raptor, Bane, Alanius. Oh, God. It's got like some shiny writing here. Per performable Odd Eyes Unicorn. That's cool. Let's get a bit closer. Nice. You can see the nice shiny text there. Okay, we got Hollow here. Priestess with Eyes of Blue. One star. Stairs with eyes of blue. I've got a desk bot base. A Jurjanka. Jurjanka. And oh wow, is that eight stars? Nice. Ryu Okami. Ryu Okami. And there's the iconic back of them. So cool. So cool. Pokemon's just always had that place in my heart, but had it not existed, I'd definitely be a Yu-Gi-Oh fanboy. So, like I mentioned earlier, here yeah. we have Adrenaline XL Premier League official trading card game. Now, if I remember correctly, um, it used to it used to run like side by side each other. I believe, but no one really did Adrenaline. 2024. Calvin Lewin and Darwin Nunez. I believe that's, is that Rico Henry? I think it is, and Nick Pope. As of recording this, I just watched the Merseyside derby, which was an absolute snooze fest. Red card did it the game, and, uh, Liverpool somehow didn't have a player sent off as well, which was just crazy. Here we go. So we have a free digital packet. There's your code for anybody that wants it. Uh, let's go, let's do it this way. I like revealing like this. So we have an Arsenal forward. Uh, should we try and guess? Let's say Inketia. Oh, it's Gabi Jesus. Gabi Jesus. I didn't guess him because I thought he might have been like a special card. We've got Burnley forward. Lyle Taylor, maybe. Lyle Taylor. Lyle Foster, not loud. Oh my gosh, Lyle Taylor is the player that used to play for like Charlton and Nottingham Forest. Lyle Foster is who I meant. I promise. Midfield, uh, I'm gonna guess Dominguez, John Joe Shelby. Nice. We've got forward for Man United. We gotta guess Marcus Rashford, haven't we? Oh, Jaden Sancho. It's all been frozen out of the team in the minute, so not ideal. Full midfielder, let's go. Harrison Reed. Linea Dynamo. He is a great, great player. That's a nice card. Dynamo. D Y N A M O. Dynamo. Very cool design. I believe in the summer he thought he was off to buy Munich and the move fell through. Newcastle bonus card. Oh, it's the Newcastle badge. <laughs> the Newcastle badge. For any of you Geordies out there, let me go. I think, as I'm recording this, you're winning 3 now. So, congrats. Now, the 
this is the one I'm most excited to open. We have Doctor Who Battles in Time. I collected these so much and no one really did it in school but I persistently brought in my binder and it eventually got people to join in. But actually one day I had, well, I literally had the whole collection pretty much up until this set. And my binder got stolen while at school. This, this girl asked to look through my binder for swaps and never gave it back and just disappeared. And then I tried to find her at the end of the school day and she was gone and she just refused to give it back basically. And as you can tell, I'm still, I'm still not worth anything because I don't think these cards or backs or whatever have appreciated in value whatsoever because it's quite like a UK niche thing I think but oh my gosh the backs of these yeah wow this is literally like taking a trip down memory lane series maybe they probably are crickable yes I think that I think they're from season three right David Tennant's second season with Martha yeah big slave big slave we are Professor Lazarus this episode has some of the worst CGI you'll ever see in your life <laughs> Oh nice, we got a rare Dalek Sec Hybrid Chained. It's a Dalek card, that's awesome. The rest of the cult of Skaro turned against Dalek Sec when he became part human and they chained him up as their prisoner. And we've got, oh wow, we got a super rare. What the heck? We got a super rain, and I don't know if you can tell, but this is textured, yeah, you can kind of, you can see it on camera, wow, oh that is sick, <laughs> I'm absolutely buzzing with that, and then we also get a, a big slave dude, wow, Jadoon Captain, I can't believe that, that that's, that's made some amends for my uh, cards being stolen. hybrid and just like that guys we're onto our last pack and we're returning to the world of Pokemon essentially this is a bonus one because I needed to meet the minimum money threshold for free delivery with Chaos so I just bought a Lost Origin back but there are some really good cards in this set like the Giratina Alder if I got that I'd scream and ruin completely ruin this ASMR video as simple as that. As I am really struggling to get these out, but I don't want to like damage them in any way. Okay, so let's do let's do the card trick for this. One, two, three, four. We'll begin with psychic energy. Aluminium. We've got Mirage Gate. Thank you. 
16 bucks later, this is our last card of the video. Are we going to end on something good? Oh my goodness, lovely stuff. A Jira Dina V Star. If only it was the old art, but we cannot, cannot complain with that. Jira Dina V Star. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Well, let's uh, get a few of our balls. evening's video. I really, really hope you uh, you did enjoy it. Definitely something a little bit different here on the channel, but hopefully you found it relaxing and entertaining, and yeah, do let me know if it's something you'd like to see a part two of. If there's enough demand, I will of course do it, but that is going to do it for this evening's video, so if you did enjoy this video and you're 